Ladies and gentlemen, I have been itching to do a fantasy draft. It's been so long since I've done one of these. We're about to start this bad boy up. Now, what you guys are going to notice, I am the only person in the fantasy draft. That's because in today's video, I'm only competing against one other person. That is Walker. There's a lot on the line. Whoever loses this video and the winner is determined by whoever builds the best team and makes it further. I need all of you guys to go on the loser's video, let them know they lost, and comment down a forfeit. And I want it to be a good one because the loser is going to have to do it in the beginning of our next collab. Here's a big twist. We don't get to draft who is on our team. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to advance to the end of the draft. Our computer is making all of our picks for us. We're about to find out what the computer drafted for us. I'm not looking. I can't see the screen. Our quarterback is Tua. There's a good chance we end up getting a different quarterback because what we're going to be doing, we're going to be hopefully building a super team in this video. I'm going to tell you guys how in just a second. Let's finish looking through our roster. Our running back is Patterson. He is considered a superstar. He's got abilities. We don't have a fullback. No surprise. Computer never drafts you one. Wide receivers. We got Gallup. We got IU, Pringle. Palmer, Rashad Perriman. Tight end is TJ Hawkinson. I like it. 88 overall. What about the offensive line? Okay, I really hope our defense is just going to be full of studs. Left end is Chase Young. Okay, that's pretty good. We like him. Right end, we got Nick Bosa. All right. D line should be getting a ton of pressure. Defensive tackle, we got Austin Johnson. We got uh, Gallimore. Left outside linebackers, Lewis, middle linebacker, Van Der Esch. We got Cody Barton, linebackers, could probably use a little bit of work. Cornerbacks, we got Denzel Ward, we got James Bradbury, we got Isaiah Oliver, Josh Jackson. Free safety is Mike Edwards, strong safety is Jordan Poyer. We got Justin Tucker, yep, guaranteed Super Bowl. We're going to have to make some trades. Now the players I can trade for are going to be from my NFL All Day Packs, the sponsor of today's video. NFL All Day is the best place to get limited digital collectible NFT videos. We all own stuff of our favorite team, whether it's jerseys, ticket stubs. Now you can own your favorite moments that make you love football. Join in on pack drops and see what you can open and pull or hop on the marketplace and buy moments from your favorite players. And you can also sell moments to other collectors. NFL All Day is going to have regular historic drops all summer until next season. So make sure you guys are checking back often for newly minted moments of your favorite all-stars from football history. I'm about to open my first NFL All Day pack. I'm so excited for this. I'm gonna claim and open one of these Pro Bowl packs. First up, we got Devontae Smith. Is this his first touchdown in the NFL? I feel like it's gotta be. It's from uh, September 12th against uh, the Falcons. I feel like I remember this one. So we got Tyrod Taylor rolling out, intercepted. And then we got our final moment from the pack, and it's Nick Bosa, the guy who uh, so happens to be on our team. Oh yeah, Matty Ice, watch out. He's gonna bring him down, and it was a strip sack. So that right there was just one NFL all day pack. Pretty cool if you ask me. Make sure you guys click the link in the description to start buying and selling your NFL all day moments today and get your name on the wait list so you're ready for the pack drops. I'm gonna be opening the rest of the packs throughout the video. We're gonna be trading for these players and I wanna thank NFL All Day for sponsoring the video. I just asked Walker who's on his team and he said he's got Nick Bosa, Jordan Poyer, and he also has, uh, I want to say, Michael Gallup and Tua. That is super weird. Like, we could do this a thousand times and we wouldn't have, like, pretty much the same team to start. I guess that makes things, like, pretty much even. Because, yeah, if we had, let's say he had, like, Patrick Mahomes, obviously he'd have, like, a way better shot at winning this thing. As far as the first player we're going to trade for, it's going to be Kenny Moore. Nick Bosa would have been choice number one. We already have him on the team. Where's Kenny Moore? Where is, where overall is this man? We'll have Denzel Ward on the outside and then we'll have uh, Kenny Moore as our nickel corner. Now, the only tough thing is, is gonna be uh, trying to trade for all these players. That is actually pretty close. Trade accepted. So Kenny Moore, first player we're picking up. Let's see who else we're gonna get for the squad. Pack number two is a premium pack, series one from week number 13. Let's see what we got. Moment number one is Logan Cook. I mean, I wanna say the computer didn't draft us a punter, and that is a thing of beauty right there. Oh, don't even tell me. That's gonna be marked down at the one. That was kinda nice right there. Logan Cook, props, beautiful kick. Hopefully we get somebody better than a punter. Number two, oh, this is a rare. 
It's Mike Williams. We just got number 50 out of 899. Oh, you already know. 50-50 ball. Mike Williams is winning that all day. Except when it comes to my Jets franchise. A lot of times, yeah, my uh, whoever I'm playing ends up winning it. We got a Dominican Sue right here. Okay, once again, Matty Ice running for his life. We've seen that a couple times already in this video. Just like that, Mike Williams, now our fourth best player. Standard pack from week number 18. Who is this? Terrell Edmonds. We don't really need a strong safety. We already have Jordan Poyer. I want an X Factor. Hunter Henry. Now, we already have TJ Hawkinson, which is, he's a pretty good tight end. I like Hunter Henry. And if we did end up trading for him, like that'd be a really good, like number one and number two tight end. The only problem is when it comes to the sim, like Madden doesn't use like two tight ends. So I feel like he'd pretty much be worthless. Oh, it's a rare. It's Patrick Peterson. This one is uh, out of uh, 999. All right, let's see what we got. That doesn't look like Justin Fields. No, that's Andy Dalton. And he's going to gift it right to Pat Pete. Now we already picked up Kenny Moore. Who do we trade for out of this pack? We already got three good cornerbacks. I don't think we exactly need Patrick Peterson. We got Mike Edwards at free safety. We got Jordan Poyer at strong safety. Yeah, I say we trade for uh, Hunter Henry. And who knows? Maybe uh, maybe this Sam will be nice to us. We got two packs left. This is uh, one from the divisional round. Oh, this is going to be Travis Kelsey. No kidding. This is a really good one. Is this, uh, is this a game-winning touchdown? I think it was. I still can't believe that was uh, one of the best playoff games of all time. And it looks like the overtime rules in the postseason are going to change just because of uh, this one game right here. Wait, Travis Kelsey would be another tight end for us. I don't know if like, would that even really help us? Like, what do we do with three tight ends? Last up, we have the Super Bowl pack. Hopefully we get something good out of here. This is Alex Singleton from the Eagles. I know we need some linebackers, but uh, I don't know if he's who we're looking for. He made a good play right here. It's actually uh, going to be a defensive touchdown. We got a quarterback. It's just uh, it's Josh Johnson. So, yeah, I, I think I'm going to stick with Tua. We got a moment from the Super Bowl, but it's Henderson. That's like, uh, yeah, we don't need another running back. And then the final moment, it's going to be Nick Chubb. That's fine by me. We'll take it. That, uh, yeah, gives us what? A 99 overall running back? That man is a tank. The team has been assembled. So an 84 overall, we got two at quarterback. We got Nick Chubb and Patterson for our running backs. We picked up Big Mike. He's going to be our wide receiver number one. We got Gallup. We got Brandon Ayuk. Uh, tight ends. We got three of them. That's, like, not ideal. But we got 99 Travis Kelsey. We got Hawkinson. And we got Hunter Henry. And then for our defense, our uh, pass rushers coming off the edge. We got Chase Young and Nick Bosa. We picked up uh, Kenny Moore. He's going to be a pretty good quarterback for us. It'll be interesting. I don't know, like, uh, what to expect from this team. I guess we'll see. Let's sim the midseason to start. We'll see uh, We'll see how the team's looking halfway through the year. We're doing pretty good. We're 5-2. It looks like the Falcons are solid. They're 4-2. We're simming straight to the playoffs. I'm confident. I feel like we had a solid start. I know for a fact Walker made the playoffs. So as long as we make it, I feel like if we win a game or two, we should be all right. Moment of truth. Here we go. We are... Wait, did we make the playoffs? We're the number one seed. Wait, didn't we have six losses? I'm so confused. So we won the division. We were tied with the Falcons at 11 and six. And we, we were the number one seed. Look at the records in the NFC, 11 and six, 11 and six, 11 and six, 11 and six, 10 and seven, 10 and seven, nine and eight. We had the ninth best offense in the NFL. We had over 6,300 yards, the 13th ranked defense. So it looks like we were kind of like in the middle to a not that good of a year. That's what we like to see. Nick Chubb, almost 1,500 yards, 22 touchdowns. Patterson added uh, 540 yards. He had 10 touchdowns. We had no 1,000 yard receivers. Mike Williams had 990. Gallup had 914. Nick Chubb had 674. Kelsey had 607. And then look at this. Hunter Henry had 18 yards. And Hawkinson had 14. I tried telling you guys, having multiple tight ends, it's like, it's useless. It's so pointless in the sim. Uh, what about sacks? Chase Young, 14 and a half. Nick Bosa had 11. Interceptions. 
Our boy Kenny Moore had three. Denzel Ward added three more. Nick Chubb is going to win MVP. That's a little surprising. I mean, I guess Nick Chubb did have uh, 2,000 yards total from scrimmage. We're taking on the 9-8 and eight Rams who have Patrick Mahomes. Why is that like... How did they go 9-8? and eight? They're the seventh seed. They beat the uh, the number two Seahawks pretty easily. Why do I feel like we're about to lose? I have a really bad feeling about this. So they got Patrick Mahomes. They got Bakhtiari, Rodney Hudson. So that's a very good uh, offensive line so far. They got Quinn and Williams. Betonio, another good O-lineman. They got AB. They got uh, Sertan, who's a superstar. Rashawn Evans. They got Hunter Renfro, Landry. Maybe this team isn't as good as I thought. Let's see what happens. So they started on offense. They struck first. We're down 7-0. We're going to add a field goal. So after the uh, first quarter, we're down 7-3. I'm going to start slowing this down a little bit. It looks like they're driving. Come on. We got to hold them. Oh, it was a turnover. I don't know if they went for it. If we got like an interception or a fumble recovery. We got the ball back. That's so big. If they score there, we go down like 14-3. Uh, to Would not have been looking good. All right, I want to start running more. That's going to be a penalty. Whenever I see the yellow, I get uh, concerned because uh, sometimes that means uh, it's a, a turnover. We are, uh, we're going to add another field goal, Justin Tucker. Patrick Mahomes to Hunter Renfro for 70 yards. I don't like the way this is looking. Third and four. We're going to pick it up. Tua, he's going to find Mike Williams. Need a touchdown right here. And we got one. It's going to be Pringle, of all people. Fourth and inches. They're going to punt. So we got a minute to work with. Come on. I want to say we picked up the first. Oh, that's a big play. Travis Kelsey. That's not good. We get sacked for nine yards, 17 seconds. Uh-oh. We're going to take a field goal. Justin Tucker, he's going to add another one. We're up by two. We got ball to open the second half. I would love to see us come out and just start uh, running the rock and dominating some clock with uh, Nick Chubb. We are uh, kind of lagging right now. That's not looking good. We're going to have to punt. Chase Young getting back-to-back -back sacks. We're getting this ball right back. Let's go. Okay, we're going to get sacked, but we're going to answer. Pringle again for 29 yards. We're going to have third and short. And we got the touchdown, Mike Williams. That's going to put us up by nine. They do have Patrick Mahomes. So we can't count them out just yet, though they're running a lot, which I'm fine with. That's uh, going to keep that clock moving. We are now officially in the fourth quarter. Come on, boys. Oh, that was fourth down. They turned it over. We can really put this game away. That's Travis Kelsey for 31 yards. We're going to win. Let's go. Michael Gallup, 18-yard touchdown. This one's over. Patrick Mahomes had 354 yards. Looks like he had a really good game. They just couldn't score. They would drive down. We would force a turnover. Big game out of Tua. Had three passing touchdowns. Nick Chubb over 118 yards rushing. Time for the conference championship. We're taking on the Falcons. They had the same record as us, which means they were uh, they could have very easily been the one seed. But it looks like we had the tiebreaker over them. So they have uh, Jair Alexander, 99. They got Chandler Jones, Melvin Gordon, Kelvin Ridley, Deion Jones. They got Jenkins, Goddard, Derek Carr, Robert Woods, Marcus May. They got Sewell. They got Tony Pollard. JC Horn, he's solid. They got JPP. This team is, uh, I mean, it's good. But I don't know if, uh, I don't know. I feel like we can win this. We're going to sim the first quarter. Let's see what happens. They're going to take a 7-0 lead. We're going to take another field goal. It seems to be our theme of uh, the playoffs so far. We're at the two-yard line. And we're going to score. Patterson going to run it in. Let's keep moving quick. We're going to go uh, straight to halftime. They're going to tie it. We're going to take a 13-10 lead. They got a touchdown. All right. So we find ourselves down four points. Let's sim the third quarter. We do get the ball to start. We did nothing with it. Oh, this is not looking good. We're down by 11. Headed into the fourth quarter. And they're, uh, they're already in striking distance. Oh, no. Derek Carr, the pass goal. Come on, defense. Not like this. We are going to hold them to a field goal. We're down by 14. We still have hope. That's Pringle for 30 yards. Come on. Tua, lead the boys. That ain't good. 10-yard penalty. I mean, at least it's not a sack. 26 yards for Gallup. We need a touchdown. We got third and goal from the eight. Oh, no. Pass is knocked away. So we're going to have fourth and goal. And we got stopped. Wow, we went to Kelsey. We only got five yards. And they're going to pick up a first. 
We are going to get the ball back, but yeah, this is... Uh... Oh, actually, I think Tua just threw an interception. So we're going to end up losing to the Falcons. Derek Carr had 320 yards. Our cornerbacks, like, I thought they were decent. We had three solid CBs. They uh, didn't do too much for us. We gave up 120 yards to Pascal. Falcons are in the Super Bowl. Hopefully they win it. That'll make me feel a little bit better. Wow, they dominated the Bengals. How? I feel like that team wasn't even that good. Melvin Gordon won MVP. You guys will have to let me know in the comments if I uh, if I won, if Walker won. Like I said, whoever lost, make sure you go to uh, to their video, comment, you know, a forfeit. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. Also, huge shout out to uh, NFL All Day for sponsoring. Make sure you guys check them out in the description down below. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.